welcome to the wedding of B and Ryan, two of our favourite people in the world. Ryan and B have a lot in common. They are both very hardworking, generous, passionate and quite stubborn people. They're really like a fine wine. B gets better every year and Ryan will take too long to mature. <laughs> Elizabeth Ann, soon to be Steen, my rock, my soulmate. I promise to support you in the home field with patience, love and understanding. I promise that every Saturday I will back a few winners to be able to buy you lobster. <laughs> you have seen the good, the bad, and the ugly side of me, yet you have stuck around. Are you crazy? <laughs> I vow to be your biggest fan and partner in crime. I promise to continue to be the songbird of this generation and sing every song possible for you. I promise to always make you laugh, even if it means laughing at me. You know, he's the biggest clown. His worst trait is he's never taken anything seriously. Every chance he gets to drive me nuts, he does. Uh, one night I pull up at his house, it's dark, and for some reason the dickhead's running around with a balaclava on. <laughs> and I say, seriously, mate, what, what's wrong with you? He shouts back, no face, no case. B isn't one of my craziest friends all the time. She doesn't like to drink too much, but at least we always know we can get home. Well, I mean, if she doesn't have a migraine or and answers her phone, that is. If you can't get a hold of B, you can bet she's curled up in the bath or on the lounge with a tea, reading a book or listening to Ryan yell at the TV, Paris on fire. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Not only are you my best friend, but the love of my life. I am so proud of what we have already achieved and can't wait to see what the future holds. Ryan, I love you. I promise to love you unconditionally and stand by your side forever. <laughs> <laughs>